Body cams, the topic of discussion between Raleigh police and the community tonight. It is the first of several community meetings. CBS North Carolina's Michael Highland talking with police and community members about the concerns ahead of this rollout. Michael. When officers get out of their cars, you could be on camera. Some people in Raleigh think this is going to increase transparency, but others are skeptical. When the flashing lights turn on in Raleigh, so could the camera. If you just rely solely on the word sometimes of law enforcement that it's not always trusted. Raleigh police are preparing to outfit officers with body worn cameras. It's estimated they'll cost about three and a half million dollars up front and nine hundred thousand dollars each year for maintenance. Body cameras is definitely in a move in the right direction uh, in terms of uh, transparency. Police started a series of meetings Monday in communities across Raleigh. People got a chance to see the cameras and ask about the department's policies. Under state law, the video is not public record. You know, it may be a domestic violence or a sexual assault, and people that are victims in those crimes have rights to privacy. The police can allow people who are recorded to view the video, but releasing it requires a court order. It, it undoubtedly um, complicates the entire situation. I think there's always going to be kind of challenges as we embrace a new technology that becomes available. Ultimately, this is a technology that does improve transparency. You're making me go through, jump through loops to get it. So therefore, do I really want it? Am I going to go pursue it? Police are asking for this feedback as they refine their policies before the cameras go on citywide. The city will roll this out in phases with the first 200 cameras next year. That's one third of them. And if you want to weigh in on this policy, we've got the schedule of these meetings going on for the next six weeks on our WNCN mobile news app. Live in Raleigh, Michael Hyland, CBS North Carolina.